What up, everybody? It's your man, Lucky Braxton. How in the fear of is you doing? I haven't made a vlog in so long, but check out what we're doing today. We're heading into the city to meet up with Craig Adams because he's got a workshop going on, a YouTube workshop that I hopefully get some value out of, make some connections. So that's what we're getting ready to do. I got my DLSR with me, my 7D in full effect. But for right now, we're on the S110, as you can see. S110. Oh, it's so cute. It's still so cute. Also, it works. India is so dope. What the fuck? I got mosquitoes in the winter time. Yo, this one part of the workshop, we talked about originality. You know, like how Sarah Dietschy be walking with the hustle team across New York in the slow motion and shit? I ain't about to do that in the next clip. Just don't work. Just be happy. Love, peace, and harmony. It's really simple, actually. Just don't work. Just be happy. Love, peace, and harmony. It's really simple, actually. All right, so I did it, but I ain't never seen the booster board that close before. Thank you. Appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna send you like a little boring Google form just for feedback, but that would mean the world to me. Knowing like knowing what to do, what was helpful, what was not helpful. Be honest with that. Alright, so it's like a week later almost. It's Thursday. Uh, most of the footage that you just got done watching was from the past Saturday. I really should have brought gloves. Holy crap, it is cold out here and it started snowing again. Everything is ice. But yeah, so what I've been doing since then is I, I, I didn't know if like what he was talking about was real, right? I didn't know if like what Craig was talking about, like, was that a cash grab? I don't know him personally. I know that I'm invested in the brand of his YouTube channel. And so these last couple of days, like I've been implementing everything that I learned at the workshop and I'm already seeing results. 
and that sounds crazy but i think the biggest thing that i walked away from from the workshop was mindset community you know what i mean those are the two things that mostly stood out for me you know what i mean and i think uh i think that i don't know there's all these little hints from the universe right as crazy as that sounds i'm gonna sound like stupid right now or whatever but i don't even really care because as crazy as it sounds like i've been asking the universe for this sort of attention for a long time now and i feel like i'm finally starting to get some of it and for the first time i think walking out of that workshop as stupid as it sounds i mean it worked differently from other people like i met some of the other guys that were there i'll link them all down all their igs will be down uh in the description but those are some really cool ass dudes and then like meeting the other entrepreneurs like craig's friends like chris hall was there you know jeremy Cohn was there alex castro was there you know what I'm saying? So it's like, and then we got to hear, like they spoke, they took time out of their day to like come and like help their friend out who was doing a workshop. Like, I don't know if it's gonna be real. I hope I get some value out of it. And I 100% feel like I got value out of that. And I started, like I said before, I was like slowly implementing things throughout this whole week, just different ways and mindsets that he was talking about in the workshop. And I started doing it and I started seeing results. And for the first time, it's like, yo, I can see myself doing what I want to be you know what I mean like I can envision myself like I can see myself and I feel like having the confidence in yourself you know what I'm saying and actually see yourself doing it and doing the thing that you want to do I think that that's huge I'm not gonna even lie like for the end of last year the last six months of 2017 I, I wasn't really active and the biggest thing that I was re like really working on was like mindset because over everything else changing your mindset for me is like one of the hardest things like talking to people like you know what I mean like making new friends I'm not good at that kind of stuff um, so that's why going to the workshop was a huge thing for me so I just think that it was really really dope it was a dope experience and I'm already off to the races as far as I can, as far as, like, as far as I'm concerned, because you talk about wanting to do something, right? You talk about wanting to be whatever it is that you want to be. Like, I want to do this full time eventually, right? And I think going to that workshop, I could, for the first time, I can actually envision, like, I can see myself doing that. And I've been reaching out to people. I got a meeting next week with another YouTuber that's right in my backyard, right here in Connecticut. And I just think it's really dope. Like, I just think it's dope. And you're gonna see some changes on my channel, yet again. You're gonna see some changes on my Instagram, you know what I mean? And like, narrowing down things. The other thing that I really, really, like, I've been really interested in is this whole minimalism movement. Um, I think that it's something, you know, I think it's something that I need. I started doing it with social media. I started like getting rid of all the stuff that's a distraction, people that are a distraction, like carving things out of my life that are a distraction. And I don't know, I just, I'm feeling good. I think the whole experience and actually like talking to the universe and asking the universe for things, I think it's really working out for me because I'm starting to see like these little things are starting to happen. So. That's it for this video. I'm gonna get up out of here. It's your man, Lucky Braxton. Uh, if you like this video, like it. If not, don't. And uh, I'll see you in the next video. All right, peace.